What is going on guys? My name is Robin back again from Run Reviews here with another episode of reaction to Konosuba episode 4 of the season 3 Divine Punishment for this handsome gentleman thief. I'm gonna be real with you real quick. Some people are probably not gonna like this. That's fine, because this is just my own personal opinion. Out of all the shows that I'm watching, this is the least one I'm actually looking forward to, which I would not expect. I think it's because, sure, having a comedy is nice and dandy. But I think the uniqueness of the show is wearing off. First season, phenomenal. Something I'd never seen before. The isekai that doesn't treat itself seriously. It's a joke. Everyone's horrible, like, dumb, stupid people, but also, like, mischievous. It was great. Characters are still great. But I think... And then I watched second season. Second season. Hilarious. Follow the path. But now we're on season three. What has happened in these four, three episodes, the first three? That's significantly plot heavy. Nothing. We got to know a little bit about this thief that's been going around, which I'm still calling as Chris. But that's it. I mean, the comedy is there. I will never say it's not there. You've seen me laugh. I don't fake my reactions. But what is there? Like, I need something more than just laughs because it's the characters. But after a while, I need something more. Follow a story. That's why I couldn't really get into things like... I don't know. I Like, I think if I'm going to watch something, the hilarity factor can be there. But if that's all they're leaning towards, I I'm kind of a little bit eh. I want to see more connections. Now, I didn't see the side stories, so that could have changed my mind. But I want to see... We already know that there is a connection between Kazuma and Megumin. Dive into that more. That's what I actually care for more than anything. Throw the humor in there as you always do. It'll knock it out of the park, but focus on something. We got to focus on Iris, I believe the princess was. I, I, I mean, it was nice. It's cute. At the end of the day, I don't care. I want to see more about our characters. Whether it be through... Um, I'm totally drawing a blank. Uh, Union. Although we get to see a little bit about that. And I know that there's a side story. So that one's probably covered. But I want to see more of darkness. A little bit more of darkness. Something new. We got a little bit. And that was great. But I want to see more. And sure, this is tied in. She's tied in because it's a sister. But it was all about the sister, not about her. Nothing. Okay. I want to see more about her, though. Maybe Aqua. Maybe. Aqua, eh, I mean, we kind of already know, but maybe a little bit more? Something? I don't know. I want to see more of Megumin. Like, but specifically Megumin and Cosmo. I want to see that. I know it's going to happen eventually, probably, but that's what will cause me to stick with that sh this show. Because as I'm looking at it right now, I would probably drop this and watch this on my own. I wouldn't watch it week to week. This episode is probably going to be the make or break in all honesty. And I... I, I, I want to be truthful to you guys and explain why, like, how I'm looking at things. I don't want to bullshit you. Is the show good? Yes. 100%. I don't if I say anything less, I'd be lying to myself and to you guys. Is it something that I'm looking forward to it's for compared to everything else I'm watching? Absolutely not. Like I said, let's say everything, the top three are right here. Next is probably Bartender Glass. I got right under that. Kona is all the way down there and you can't even see it. It's low my priority. Like, I actually thought about just skipping it this week. But, I usually give it three episodes. I've been having fun, but I need more. I guess that's what I'm going to say. So we'll see. This episode will be the make or break. Um, or I know some people give me in the comments be like, Oh, no, you should probably watch because it's going to get better. And I'm sure, and I'm, I'm not going to doubt any of you guys, but... That's just how I'm feeling right now. I wanted to like talk about it beforehand. Actually, I don't know. Just personal opinions. Just how I've been feeling. But yeah, I'm ready to jump into episode four. Hopefully this is going to capture my attention even more. Uh, it hits something that I want. That's all I can hope for. And if not, I mean, it's okay. I, I have nothing wrong with people saying this is a great show. That they want to continue watching. But for me, we'll see. It's just how I'm feeling right at this moment.
the next 20 minutes could completely change the narrative and perspective. I'm hoping. I don't want to, I don't like dropping series, but we'll see. But yeah. Anyways, let's jump in. It's episode four of Konosuba. I do apologize for it being slightly sad or just not fun. But yeah, I just want to be transparent with you guys about how I'm feeling. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, for listening, and let's get on to watching. Words are hard. All right, so without further ado, let's jump in to Konosuba episode four of season 37 and three. Two, one, let's jam. Like, I know I'm going to be laughing this episode. <laughs> I'm choking. <coughs> oh, sorry, this went down the wrong way. He's got a point. Creep. <laughs> That's interesting that I actually cut into the intro. All right, so I'm skipping the intro as usual. My guess is it's still got to be Chris. I just trying to figure out how, why. It's the only thing that makes sense. Is it her changing? Oh, you're a piece of shit. I mean, we already knew this. Bullshit, Cosma. What are you, he's gonna be like, wait a second, what do you mean use this room? <laughs> Should like it though. If it's Cosma, not this guy. Christ. Birds of a feather. Good job, darkness. I don't know how you got in there without them paying attention, but yes. They kind of the door. <laughs> sure. Please develop this. Please develop more of this. Jeez. 
This is what I want. Really? I realize that there is like two Mega Moon. This is probably in a form of a date, but still. Ah! How are you not noticing her? How are you not noticing it's her? How? 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 <laughs> Boy. <laughs> Are you groping her? Actually, let's call us someone. Oh, so yeah, you violate her. All of them. All, well, all, yeah. Maybe explain yourself. I'm assuming it's like a Robin Hood thing. Is he gonna play it off like he was hungry? I can see him. Are you?
They were like, you're a bad liar. Huh? Uh oh. What doll? What doll? Am I totally miss? Am I totally drawn? Like drawn a blank? <laughs> so they're slightly uh, they're getting a little off on this For a split second, I thought, the, I thought it ended. Hmm. Well, they call it bubbly. Why do you say balloons? Where's the meat? Oh, hey. I have a worse memory than you. Well, actually, and probably not, but. You literally reincarnated him. I don't remember his name. No. I'm terrible with names, I will admit that. Just, oh.
I mean, I'll get the tab on. Did I? Wait, wait, wait. I actually called her what she was about to say. Don't grow up her again. <laughs> it's got to be something important. Oh, was that hammer thing that the one that causes every time it um you shake it, it causes coins to drop? I mean, it's weird in the Disney world. Oh, okay. Oh, so was that mouth thing from a reincarnated person? It's going to piece it together. So who is she hired by? <laughs> uh oh. How does he not? <laughs> yes. Chicken Aqua. Hey, at least Mega Man's getting ready. So blow them up before anything happens so no one there's no collateral damage. She's got a point, and especially if it's a one and done, she's out of commission.
I'm actually with Megumin completely on this. I think it's a smart move. I mean, just have you not to pay attention to things. I had a feeling this is where it was going to end. All right, skipping the credits real quick. I do. I will always appreciate that it cuts off. All right. This episode did nothing to change my mind. Sure, we get a little bit of a plot point with the whole, like, clientele doing this weird thing, collecting all these artifacts. It's not really doing anything for me yet. I, okay, I'm, I'm going to be honest. The Megamine saying we should go on a date, it actually really made me excited, and then they pull that. I know it's probably to her, it probably is to her, but that's not what I wanted. That actually, that actually was a slap in the face to me. So I don't know. Um, I'm I'm really struggling to continue on, to be honest. Um, I I never would have thought I would have said this about Konosuba. It just it feels like it's dragging, and not and maybe not to others. Like to me, like what I want, I'm not getting it. To other people, I I like if it's just comedy you're looking for, a hundred percent sure. It's not what I'm wanting right now. Maybe that's why. Maybe it's just my just a phase that I'm currently in that I'm like, eh. I don't know. <sighs> just how I'm feeling. I know this video is gonna get disliked. I can I, I know and I understand. I get it. I'm trying. But I don't want to lie to you guys either. Uh we'll see. Um maybe next week I'll have a i I'll have a change of mind, a change of pace, and we'll go from there. But uh yeah. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you guys think in the comments section below. I know you, I'm sure I'm going to get comments just talking about, like, things. And I will read them, so don't worry. I'll, I'll make a decision. I'll make a decision, but yeah. Um, but yeah, that's, that's it. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys on Saturday for Kaiju number 8. Until then, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.